Hello everybody and welcome to another episode of Back to Basics. Uh, today we're going to cover a few things. Uh, let's go ahead and get right into it. Oh, I keep turning on off my head. Ah. Okay, so uh, the things I wanted to cover, uh, obviously I have a, 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 um, a sign saying enchanting. So I want to do that, but I don't know that we'll get it to this episode. Because I want to do a little bit of remodeling because we do need an enchantment room before we can go ahead and delve into enchanting. So... Uh, I want to first of all cover the ites because that's what I'll be building with today. Now we have diorite, granite, and andesite. Okay. Now in order to make these, you need to put um, a piece of quartz. I believe I can show you actually. So if we go ahead and go to our nether chest, which we have right here, we'll take two pieces of quartz. Uh, we'll take another one just just in case we need it, and then we'll go ahead and take some cobble, um, and I'll go ahead and show you. So now to make to make the diorite, you need to do this, and then this, and boom, you get diorite. Okay, now once you have the diorite, you can go ahead and make granite by adding another piece of quartz. You get granite, right? Or alternatively, you can also make this. You can make uh, andesite by combining, I believe it's two pieces of diorite and two pieces of cobble, if, I, if I'm not mistaken. Diagonally, once again. It might be the other diagonals. Is it like that? Nope. Okay, so is it one and one? It is one and one. Okay. So it's just one and one, and you get two pieces of andesite for that. So yeah, so now you know how to make all the uh, all of them. And now I'm going to go ahead and take all the diorite we have. And let's go ahead and grab some more of that. Oh, I, I walked right away from it. Some more of the nether quartz. Um... We're going to use a little bit more. I don't know how much. Uh, we're going to have to obviously go back to the nether and farm quite a bit of quartz. Um, so that we can remodel our nether portal area down downstairs. Um, but we'll do that in another episode. And we'll have it all. We'll do it all like at once. If you, if you understand what I mean. And then we'll have a bunch of experience as well. And we'll be able to enchant at the same time. Okay, so now that we have 44 pieces of a diorite, what we can do is we go ahead and put it in a 2x2 two two, and we make polished diorite. Now with this polished diorite I kind of want to replace the floor here so I'm gonna replace from here to here uh, all the way around and then I'll leave the cobble up to this place so I'm gonna I'm gonna get rid of all this here up to there so yeah I'll be right back I'll probably fast forward this place of music over it uh, I'll see you guys in a minute Okay, and now I have um, I finished that, but I actually don't like it. Uh, now I'll explain to you why. It's first of all because this weird pillar is here. Um, we're gonna have to replace those blocks up there in a second. But uh, the the main reason is because it's not even. So you'll see two, and then on this side we have three wide from the staircase. So I think I'm gonna go ahead and get rid of this, and then we I think we're gonna fill it back up with cobblestone. Oh no, I'll just fill this area up with cobblestone for now. Uh, and then we'll have to make some some decisions. Let's go ahead and combine our pickaxes. Remember, you get an extra five percent. So uh, hold on, I think it is. If I press F3 and H, then it will turn on our. Yes, it will. It will turn on our in, our durability for everything. So let's go ahead and turn this off. Uh, it, so we can see exactly how much durability. So we have 159 here, and we have 28 here. And so when we go ahead and combine them, 159 plus 28 is 188. No, that's 187, right? So it should be 187, but it is 199. So you do get a little bit of an extra return if you did not know that. I know I've already said it in an episode, but I figured maybe somebody missed it. Uh, no big deal. I would go ahead and explain it again. Um, now that we have this actually figured out, I, I, I like it a lot more. Um, I want I want to do something else with like the floor over in this area, which is why I'm going to go ahead and pick up this stuff right here, andesite. 
and we're going to go ahead and work with that for a little bit. Uh, I'm going to fill up this floor over here all with andesite, except for up to this point, because this will be obviously our nether portal area, and we are going to have to decorate that a little bit differently. Um, so I'll go ahead and uh, start crafting this area a little bit. Like, like I said, I want to make it look a little bit more like a home. We're still going to make it so that you can exit through uh, a few different paths here, but I, I really want it cleaned up. I also want to do something with these walls and stuff because I don't really like how um, how it's a bunch of different materials, um, but that is also going to have to wait. Oh, I want to replace this too. Go ahead and do that. Boom. Oh, it looks It's starting, it's starting to look good, um, and we're just going to keep cleaning it up. And yeah, let me go ahead and grab some, some sleep, and then I'll go ahead and uh, fast forward it for you guys, and uh, I'll see you when I'm done. Oh yeah, if I didn't already show it off, I, I forgot about this. If I didn't already show it off, the ites, uh, the andesite here, you can also make into smooth. Looks a little bit something like this. And then if you take that, and it's polished, and you go like this again. Oh no, that's pocket edition, sorry. Uh... But yeah, you get polished andesite, and I think it looks really nice. It's It looks a lot like the stone, if you can see, but it just looks a little bit cleaner than stone. So yeah, like I said, I'm going to go ahead and fill out this area here, and then uh, I'll be right back. As you just saw, uh, I grabbed a ton of iron and gave myself uh, another level there. If you if you didn't see it, I uh, figured I'd slow down and tell you guys. Um, and then I also I also followed the andesite cave as you just saw back into here. Uh, and I was actually thinking about it, and I want to open this up a little bit more anyway. So I'm not gonna fill this up quite yet. That's why I'm cooking that stone so that I can make it look like it's filled up quite nicely. Um, but I don't want to do that quite yet, like I said. Um, I, I, I want to make that open because we are going to have a castle theme, as you guys know. Um, and I think it'll look better, uh, the bigger we make this downstairs. Okay, I'll see you guys in a bit. Okay, so I don't know how much really of that I am going to cut out and, and what I'm going to do, but I figured I'd go ahead and show you guys something else that we can do with this stuff. Uh, we can go ahead and make stairs, I believe. Uh, not out of the polished, apparently. We should be able to make it out of regular andesite, correct? No, wow. I swear I, th I saw stairs out of these guys. Hmm, well that's a bummer. Okay, so what we're going to have to do instead, we're going to have to go ahead and take, I believe it is smooth stone, and we're going to go ahead and put it into a formation like this so we get the bricks and once we have stone bricks we're going to go ahead and make stone brick steps here and then I'm going to go ahead and use those downstairs and I'll show you guys when I'm all done with it okay so we have a problem zombies keep coming in if you didn't notice uh, it's not really a big problem it's because I've been working at night but it is something that uh, we're going to have to fix somehow here in the near future just thought I'd uh, say something about it because it keeps happening Okay, I'll get back to it. Okay, guys, so I am uh, I'm done with the remodel almost. Now, I say almost because there's just one more thing that I really wanted to do. Uh, I will go ahead and show you guys. Obviously, I need to fix that hole or whatever. But uh, this is what we have so far. Obviously, we have this new floor that I had showed you already. And then we have this nice... Uh, floor here and we have a an unlimited water source this still counts as unlimited water source because i have uh, water blocks under here so i can just go ahead and pick up water whenever i need it i uh, will keep my bucket full actually and then i made this nice open area and when i was clearing that out i obviously saw um some open air when i felt when i uh when i had 
cut back here so I went ahead and made us a nice window just so we can see outside the back of the house uh, a little bit more clearly uh, we also have this little area back here I don't know what we're gonna tuck back here yet but uh, I really do like the look of it I think it turned out very nicely now my last thing that I wanted to do before I uh, I move on to what we're gonna do next um, is kind of vault the ceiling a little bit and open up this nice this pillar right here a little bit more and I also wanted to replace this all with uh, smooth stone just so it looks a little bit more um, a little bit more fluid like look it just looks a little bit more clean um, so I will do both of those things and then I will uh, be back with you guys so I went a little bit crazy <laughs> <laughs> it's uh, probably an understatement, um, but I figured I'd show you guys what I've done so far. Uh, I need to go down into the mines and actually grab some more coal because we're starting to run low on that. And uh, I need it to cook some more smooth stone. So I'm going to go ahead and make another pickaxe here. And then I'll jump down into the mine. I'll, I'll go grab it. You guys don't have to watch all that, obviously, but I'll show you guys what I've done so far. So clearly, I'm still fixing up this wall. I w I'm going to make it look a little bit more natural. I'm also going to get rid of all this stuff, replace all that with smooth stone, uh, and make it just look a, a general a little bit better. Um, yeah, and... and uh, I am also going to, as you can see, I... I cleared out a little bit more here. It looks a little bit crazy, but it's supposed to. Um, I actually want to get rid of this. I, I, I don't like the look of this here. But remember, I don't know what I'm going to do around the Nether portal yet. But we need to go to the Nether to do uh, to, to pick out what we want to do. I know this this looks really ugly, um, and I apologize for that. But obviously, there's there's I I've done a lot of work so far down here, and I I actually am starting to like the look of it. I also had another great idea. Uh, we're I think I'm gonna make a little like uh, balcony out here so we can look out this way. I'll probably end it up there because that's what this naturally looks like with these grass here. It kind of looks like a fence, so I'm gonna replace it with a fence. I don't know what I'm gonna use for outside stones yet uh, out here to make it look nice and clean, um, but it, it will it will look nice and clean when I'm done. Uh, and then this, I think I might just make this into like uh, stone under here, and then I'll fill it in because I don't want this all to be open. I want it to look like it's overhanging, like um, like it's an opening to a cave almost, but with just like a balcony here. Um, I obviously have a lot of ideas going on in my mind, so I think I'm gonna go down in the cave if I run into anything. Um, I'll let you guys know and then and then we'll see we'll see where we want to go from there. Okay, so it turns out that nothing really super eventful. I didn't find anything super nice in the caves. Um, but I, I did obviously grab a lot of coal, 46 pieces. I flashed it real quick. I didn't want to lose our progress on the, uh, the ladder. Um, so here's the deal. Uh, I want to show you one... No. I want to show you one more crafting recipe um, before we end the episode. Um, it's actually pretty cool. I think I'm going to try to use it as the outdoor patio pattern like the the one I, that i was like oh i don't know what i'm gonna do out here um and i'll go ahead and show it to you now we're gonna run upstairs and what it is is it's you make the stone bricks by cooking stone obviously um we'll just go ahead and divvy all this up real quick stacks of eight so it cooks 64 at a time and we'll get all these going so on the next episode we will be prepared to um work on our next piece okay so we got that cooking now we'll go ahead and wait for these guys uh, we don't actually need much more we need three more pieces of stone 
So that means that all these should be good. Okay, so now what we're going to do is we're going to make the, obviously, the stone bricks, as I showed before. So now we have five stone bricks. We're going to go ahead and make that into slabs. And then once you make that into slabs, you're going to actually put those slabs on top of each other. And it turns it into chiseled stone bricks. Now, these chiseled stone bricks, obviously, I already had some in my inventory. Uh, they look pretty awesome. I'll go ahead and set them down to show them to you guys. Uh, I think this is what we're going to use on the outside. Uh, on the patio, just just the place you walk. It won't be everywhere. And then the other recipe that I will be using, while um, uh, for for the castle kind of theme that we're gonna keep going, is this one right here. Uh, it's two by three. If I if I haven't shown this already, I think I may have somewhere. Um, it is the cobblestone walls and cobblestone walls. They work a little bit like fences, except for oh, wrong block. I apologize. Uh, I thought I had, there we go, I did it uh, wrong. Okay, um, cobblestone walls, obviously it's a pillar, right, and then another pillar, but if you connect them, it becomes flat, and wherever you connect them, besides corners, uh, it'll become flat. I don't know really how to explain it. So if I get rid of this now, see, boom, and that becomes flat. And uh, that's what I'll use for the patio outside. Uh, and I'll do that between episodes for you guys so it's not just a bunch of building next episode. And uh, next episode we are going to cover our enchanting. So thank you so much for watching you guys. I know it was a lot of speed ups and a lot of cuts in this episode. Uh, but it's, it's just part of making our house our home and all that good stuff. And I'll also do, I'll also do this work here um, between episodes for you guys. Um, thank you so much for watching once again. If you guys enjoyed the episode, please remember to hit that like button. If you're new to the channel, don't be afraid to hit that subscribe button. Uh, we're going to run away from these zombies. We're going we're gonna to have a nice nap. Oh, we can't rest now because there's zombies nearby. Oh, uh, yeah, hit that subscribe button. Thank you so much for watching. Let me just kill the zombie and we'll end the episode. Got him. Okay, I'll see you guys later.